guys and I'm going to show you how to get GBA for iOS and this happens to be take two because when I opened it and I started playing the ROM well I mean I can open the application as I did before yeah 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 don't don't bother me with that shit anyways <laughs> you can't translate it um I'm going to basically have to show you how to do it and install a ROM so I'm going to delete it a second time <laughs> and oh yeah by the way you do not have to be jailbroken for this this top app up here SNES for iPhone that is a jailbroken app but as you can tell I do have Cydia down there and you do not need Cydia this is just you know it's kind of a misconception but you do need Safari and Internet and an iPad assumedly or an iPhone or an iPod or whatever anyways first step you want to gonna do gonna want to do is gonna go to settings go to your date and time which is under general and then you scroll down date and time turn off set automatically set date and time and then you're gonna wanna go to the top one scroll down to 2012 and you're done for that uh, now you want to go to Safari and the link for all of this will be in the description so you want gonna want to go to emu for iOS dot weebly dot com. There's more than one site specifically to do this, but this seems to be the best in my opinion. And oh wait, it says the only and official non jailbroken place to get your favorite jailbreak only applications. Now it says set your date back to 2012, and then applications. GBA for iOS install or install <laughs> select install it's gonna be a little bit of a white icon and I'm on iOS 6 my iPhone 5 is on iOS 7 uh, I will pro I guess if it might help you can just go look up a YouTube link for a video on other people playing with their SNES iPhone stuff whatever Alright, there it is. You saw me delete it, you saw me reinstall it. Now you go back in the time settings and you just turn it this set automatically back on, wait for it to do its thing, go back, and go into the app. Yep, and a second time you tell me you can't translate. For me, to make this thing work the first time, I have to uh zoom in, zoom out, because I'm on the iPad. Anyways, you're gonna wanna press press the search button just like like I just did. And then it'll ask you, do you want to launch Safari? Because, you know, it'll say that's kind of how you get your little applications. You say, yes, I want to open Safari. And I choose Cool ROM because Cool ROM seems to be the fastest for me and it seems to be the most reliable. I mean, as I can tell, there's ROM Freaks, Emu Paradise, Free ROMs, uh, ROM Hustler, Dope ROMs, and then Cool ROM. There's a bunch. I mean, it, it's not even funny. So, we're going to do the top 25. And we're going to get... I've already downloaded Zelda the Minish Cap like three times in a row. I am done with that one. Um, uh, I don't know what to get, actually. This is kind of hard. I got so much good stuff. Pokemon was never my jam, but, you know, still very, very good. I mean, 17 million, 21 million? Holy mackerel. Alright, whatever. Final Fantasy 7. If it's a big download, uh-uh. Oh, it's not at all. And I don't even think that's 7. <laughs> I don't know what number that is. I just chose it. Anyways, what you're going to do is, after you find the game that you want and this would happen to be one of the Final Fantasy games you click download now and the prompt that's gonna give me to download uh, it won't be the same for you it'll open up in a new page after a few seconds and then it'll say do you want to open a da da application da 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 etc etc you say sure but for me I'm gonna go to where my application or little zip folder for the game just downloaded Final Fantasy VI Advance and you want to go and click in open in GBA for iOS. And then if I kind of select 
that, it'll cancel out my thing, so, that's kind of the whole tutorial. I can't really give you a better description on it than that, but I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys learned how to deal with ROMs. I'm sorry I could not give you an example of a ROM in person because I did not want my application of the screen recorder being faulty and, you know, messing up on me and see how I got. But have a good day and peace.